no physician or treatment could bring healing, as day by day my strength and hope slowly eroded. As this man named Jesus came to our town, one of the rulers fell to his feet, begging him to come and heal his daughter. I wanted to beg at his feet too, but the crowd had begun moving and nearly crushed me. He was almost beyond my reach, but I knew that if I could just touch the hem of his garment, there would be hope for me. In desperation, I reached through the crowd. In that moment, the crowd stopped, and I heard Jesus say, Who touched me? Those around him were trying to tell him that multiple people were reaching out to him, but I knew he was asking about me. My elation gave way to fear, and I was trembling as I approached him and knelt before him. In front of everyone, I told why I had reached out to him and what had just happened to me. I expected to be ridiculed, or at least scolded, for stopping the procession of one so great. But every day for the rest of my life, I remember the lovely voice of the Master as he looked, looked down to me and said, Daughter, your faith has been made whole. Go in peace. No one ever spoke as this man.